Hello everyone. Welcome back to our channel, Canada Immigration. We hope you're doing great. Well, in this episode, we'll talking about streamlining pathways to permanent residency in Canada, the Atlantic Immigration Program. Embarking on a journey to secure permanent residency in Canada has become an attainable dream for many, thanks to the innovative Atlantic Immigration Program, AIP. This groundbreaking initiative offers a streamlined pathway to Canada's vibrant Atlantic provinces, without the cumbersome requirement of a labor market impact assessment, LMIA. For those seeking an opportunity to thrive in a diverse and welcoming community while contributing to the local economy, the APE stands as a beacon of hope and possibility. In this comprehensive guide, we will delve into the intricacies of the Atlantic Immigration Program, uncovering its numerous benefits, eligibility criteria, application process, and the unparalleled opportunities it presents. Join us as we explore the gateway to a new life in Canada through the lens of the APE, and discover how this program has transformed the lives of countless individuals seeking to call Canada their permanent home. So, to get all the information, pay attention and watch the video through to the end please hit like and subscribe, and don't forget to push the notification bell for upcoming episodes. So, without any further delay, let's jump into the video. In recent years, Canada has opened its doors to immigrants from various corners of the globe, seeking to bolster its workforce, enhance diversity, and foster economic growth. One notable pathway that has gained attention is the Atlantic Immigration Program, AIP, a remarkable initiative that offers a streamlined route to permanent residency without the need for a labor market impact assessment, LMIA. This innovative program, which was initially introduced as a pilot in 2017 and later transitioned into a permanent fixture, is a key component of Canada's commitment to attracting skilled workers and international students to the vibrant Atlantic provinces. Understanding the APE Advantage At the heart of the Atlantic Immigration Program lies a range of advantages that set it apart from other immigration pathways. One of the most notable benefits is the exemption from the cumbersome LMIA requirement, making it significantly easier for employers in the Atlantic provinces to hire foreign workers. This not only simplifies the hiring process but also ensures that employers have access to a wider talent pool to meet their workforce needs. Another striking feature of the APE is the flexibility it offers with regard to age limits. Unlike some immigration programs that impose strict age restrictions, the Atlantic Immigration Program welcomes applicants of all age groups, acknowledging that skills and expertise are not confined by age. Language proficiency is an important factor in any immigration process, and the APE recognizes this by setting a moderate language requirement. Applicants need to demonstrate a minimum proficiency of Canadian language benchmark, CLB, 4 or 5 in English or French, depending on the job category they are targeting. This approach acknowledges that linguistic skills can vary, and it allows a diverse range of candidates to qualify for the program. One of the most remarkable aspects of the APE is its inclusivity. Candidates from various occupational backgrounds and industries are eligible to apply, regardless of whether their skills fall under specific no-code or tier categories. This means that a broad spectrum of jobs and professions are covered by the program, enhancing its appeal to individuals with diverse skill sets. Navigating the program, eligibility and application process. The eligibility criteria for the Atlantic Immigration Program encompass two key categories, skilled workers and international graduates. Skilled workers with at least one year of work experience, acquired anywhere in the world, are eligible to apply. Similarly, International students who have graduated from recognized post-secondary institutions in the Atlantic provinces, namely New Brunswick, Nova Scotia, Prince Edward Island, and Newfoundland and Labrador, are also eligible for international students. The APE sets specific requirements to ensure the integration of candidates into the local communities. These requirements include a minimum of two years of study in Atlantic Canada, with at least 16 months of residency in the region during the final two years of their program. This approach underscores the program's commitment to enhancing the retention of talent in the Atlantic provinces. The Road to Permanent Residency Once an applicant secures a job offer from a designated employer in the Atlantic provinces, they are well on their way to obtaining permanent residency. The province's endorsement of the job offer is a crucial step in the process, and it signifies the alignment of the candidate's skills with the region's economic needs. Upon receiving the endorsement, candidates have two pathways to choose from. The first option involves applying for permanent residency directly, while the second option allows candidates to apply for a temporary work permit. Opting for the work permit route enables candidates to start working in Canada and even apply for permanent residency while continuing to work. This option is particularly appealing to those eager to embark on their Canadian journey without delay. Exploring the Atlantic Provinces The Atlantic Provinces of Canada New Brunswick, Nova Scotia, Prince Edward Island, 
and Newfoundland and Labrador form a picturesque and inviting region that beckons immigrants with its charm, economic opportunities, and quality of life. From the historic architecture of St. John's in Newfoundland and Labrador to the stunning coastal landscapes of Nova Scotia, each province offers its own unique blend of experiences and possibilities. The Atlantic provinces have been successful in attracting a considerable number of newcomers through the ape. In 2022 alone, over 15,000 individuals found their way to Canada's eastern shores, contributing their skills to key sectors such as healthcare, manufacturing, and hospitality. With targets set to welcome 8,500 newcomers in 2023, 11,500 in 2024, and 14,500 in 2025, the program's impact is poised to continue growing. Charting your path, applying for permanent residency. When pursuing permanent residency through the Atlantic Immigration Program, prospective immigrants need to undertake a series of well-defined steps. The process begins by submitting an online application through the Permanent Residence Online Application Portal. This portal serves as the gateway for applicants to enter the immigration process and provides essential information on eligibility criteria, fees, and forms filling out the required forms is a vital component of the application process. From the generic application form to supplementary information forms, applicants must provide accurate and comprehensive information about their background, education, and work experience. Attention to detail at this stage is crucial, as these forms will be used to assess eligibility and compatibility with the program's requirements as part of the application process. Candidates are also required to demonstrate language proficiency. Depending on the skill level of the job offer, applicants need to achieve a minimum CLB or NCLC score of either 4 or 5 in English or French. To validate these language skills, results from designated language test organizations must be submitted along with the application. Financial Planning Settlement funds and endorsement. To ensure a smooth transition for newcomers, the Atlantic Immigration Program mandates the provision of settlement funds. This financial requirement varies based on family size and aims to guarantee that immigrants and their families can comfortably settle and establish themselves in their new home. While these funds are not necessary for individuals already working in Canada, they are an essential component for those immigrating from abroad once a job offer has been secured and the settlement plan is in place, the province will endorse the job offer. This endorsement is a testament to the alignment of the candidate's skills with the needs of the region, and it serves as a pivotal step toward permanent residency. Once endorsed, candidates receive a certificate of endorsement, which must be included as part of the permanent residency application. Embracing New Beginnings, the Atlantic Immigration Program The Atlantic Immigration Program stands as a testament to Canada's commitment to welcoming skilled workers and international graduates with open arms. By providing a clear and well-structured pathway to permanent residency, it not only enriches the lives of immigrants but also contributes to the growth and development of the Atlantic provinces. As you embark on your journey toward permanent residency through the APE, meticulous preparation, adherence to requirements, and a proactive approach are your greatest allies. With the Atlantic provinces breathtaking landscapes, vibrant communities, and promising economic prospects awaiting, the program offers an opportunity to forge a bright and fulfilling future in one of Canada's most captivating regions. The Atlantic Immigration Program has emerged as a game-changer in the realm of Canadian immigration, offering a seamless route to permanent residency that bypasses the complexities of LMIA requirements. As we conclude this exploration of the APE, it is evident that this program has opened doors and shattered barriers for aspiring immigrants, allowing them to build a life in Canada's enchanting Atlantic provinces. With its focus on attracting skilled workers and international graduates, the APE not only addresses the labor needs of the region but also fosters a sense of community and diversity that enriches the cultural fabric of these provinces. As you consider your path to permanent residency, remember that the Atlantic Immigration Program is more than just a program it is a gateway to new beginnings, a chance to flourish, and an invitation to become an integral part of Canada's thriving Atlantic community. That is all for today, in this video. What are your thoughts on this? please let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching the entire video. Hopefully, the information is useful to you. See you later, in the next episode. Till then, take care.